How do? This is Comedian L.W. I'm your roving reporter, and we're here at Possum Creek Arena for the Trump, DeSantis, and Christie debate. For the first time, they're going to be taking off the gloves and going one-on-one -on -one with each other. Now, as we're starting as your narrator, I want them each to say something nice about their opponent. And we're going to start over here with Trump and ask him to say something nice about DeSantis and then about Christie. Well, DeSantis, he ain't nothing but a loser. And as far as Christie's, I'm concerned, he ain't nothing but a big old fat pig. <laughs> Woohoo, that's taken off the gloves. Now we're going to go over here and we're going to ask DeSantis to say something nice about you and Christie. Well, Donald Trump, he likes the color orange because for the next 30 years, that's the color he's going to be wearing. <laughs> and Christy, oh, he ain't even a threat to me. I don't even care about him. Well, now we're going to Christy and ask him about Trump and then DeSantis. Uh, well, like all I can say about Trump is the truth finally caught up with him, and I'm glad for that. And as far as DeSantis over here, why well, he can't even beat Mickey Mouse, so why in the world would you want to vote for him? Well, the gloves have finally come off. If this is what they say nice about each other, I'd hate to hear what they say bad about each other. Now it's Trump's turn, and we're going to ask him, what would you do if you were president again? Well, I would make America great again. That's right. I would make America great again. Well, Mr. DeSantis, what do you got to say about that? Well, it never stopped being great, you big old loser. That's all you are, a loser. Well, Mr. Christie, what do you got to say? Well, what I'm going to say, how, and where in the world are you going to make America great again? From a jail cell? Because that's where you're going to be sitting. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, now, Mr. DeSantis, it's your turn. What would you do if you were president? Why, it's just woke, 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 woke. That's all that's out there is woke, and I'd have ended. It would die here in my administration. Well, Mr. Trump, what do you got to say about that? <laughs> woke? My, you wouldn't even be governor if it wasn't for me, you loser yourself. <laughs> well, Mr. Christie, what do you got to say? <laughs> Why, you, he doesn't even know what woke is. And, and I got news for you. If he doesn't stop picking on Mickey Mouse, Minnie Mouse is going to come out and slap the snot out of him. That's what's going to happen. <laughs> well, Mr. Christie, now it's your turn. Well, I would clean up Washington, including the Trumps. I'd make sure they were all cleaned up. <laughs> well, Mr. Trump, what do you got to say in response? Uh, well, I'd clean you up, too. I'd put a lock on the refrigerator. <laughs> well, Mr. DeSantis, what would you say? Well, remember, I would end woke. <laughs> That's all he's got to say is woke. <laughs> well, this is L.W., your roving reporter from Prossum Creek, saying so long until we meet at the next debate.